Coming back to Lagos, a city that works. That was a theme that guided discussions at a conference of rural estate developers in the state. Among other things, they identified key barriers affecting the smooth functioning of Nigerian cities and proffered solutions. Karima Salami has the details. Lagos, regarded as the fastest growing economy in the country, has a population of more than 20 million people who account for the city's giant strides in boosting the nation's GDP. But it has its own challenges. Notable among them is the deficit in transportation and infrastructure. Dealing with this challenge is at the heart of discussions at the opening ceremony of the 49th Conference of the Nigerian Institution of Estate Surveyors and Valuers. The advantages of working of a working city in the areas of quality housing, sanitation, good health care, crimes reduction, efficient transportation, increase in productivity cannot be overemphasized. Minister of Power and Housing, who is also in attendance, says one sure pathway to making Lagos a model city would be to ensure that public order anchored on law is an irreducible minimum. This is what law seeks to do, to create some order and predictability in how all of us share and use the same assets whether it is land, whether it is road, whether it is health centers, whether it is sports centers, whether it is office space. Cities are doing a lot more than just providing... The state uh, government, for its part, says that investment in key infrastructure has been the backbone of policy for successive administrations in the past 20 years. Today, we are struggling. There are loads of unutilized lands, utilized, unutilized properties that estate valuers can capture. And once we capture those values, we will boost the economy of those corridors. If cities are now concerned about the happiness and well-being of their own citizens, you can imagine what it takes to achieve that. I think we are entitled to, to be there for all the Nigerian people living in our cities. The Lagos state government and its partners are determined that with the help of data technology, Lagos will become a city that truly works. Karima Salami, TVC News, Lagos.